Parkinson's disease is a progressive neurological disorder. And the major symptoms of Parkinson's are tremor, which usually manifests itself either in the hands or the feet, uh, rigidity at the joints, which basically means that the joints are stiff and, and they don't move very freely, uh, bradykinesia, which is also called slowness of movement, and then many people with Parkinson's also have posture and gait difficulties. So we're mostly focusing our Parkinson's research on looking to see if exercise could be a type of intervention for improving motor function in Parkinson's and also we started to do studies where we're looking at the role of exercise in improving cognitive function. 2004 is when I first went to the doctor. Uh, it started with a tremor in my foot actually and then my left, and then my left hand um, and that's progressed since then. I've done some reading about exercises in general and how it's supposed to benefit people with Parkinson's as well as other ailments that they might have and that's, that's my goal, to do exercise with the intention of slowing down the progress of Parkinson's. This study, we call it the PD-COG intervention and it's a, a long exercise intervention study where people come in and exercise for three times a week over an eight-week period and then we monitor their function, motor function and cognitive function over time with that. In October I started the uh, study where you do the MotoMed cycling, uh, we, where I'm pedaling for a certain period of time. What I've noticed with that is after about two or three weeks, once, I'm, once I completed the cycling, I started feeling better, my tremor was less, my thinking was clearer, at least for an hour or two. Another study that we're just starting, we just got NIH funding for this study, is actually a study to build what I'm calling an intelligent bicycle. So we're going to design an intervention exercise bike that can be used to collect information from the patients while they're exercising and then we're going to build a model with that to basically have a, 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 com a computerized bike where you could put the patient's information into that bike and then it would output a perfect exercise program for them. I am a triathlete and I'm in the exercise physiology department so I have a personal interest in the value of exercise to treat not only Parkinson's but also you know many chronic diseases and there's a push right now um, in the American College of Sports Medicine to, to look at exercise as medicine and how that can be valuable. You know my, my thinking is the more exposure I have to different exercises the better it's going to be for me in the long run for Parkinson's for mental abilities and so on. I want to make sure that I'm independent for as long as I can be. My goal is to, is to live to 100.